Hey there, I'm unpacking this week's small share of vegetables. Um, we've got a really nice bunch of um, farm carrots this week and I started separating these already so when they come with the greens on them, the tops, you want to um, separate the root from the greens and keep those separately in your fridge. Um, the roots can go in a plastic bag and the tops can go in a separate plastic bag. The carrot will keep for a couple weeks in the fridge, two to three weeks. The greens should be eaten in a couple days. Um, I know people like to make pesto out of the greens, and if you have other ideas, you should post them to the Facebook page. Um, so I'm curious about that. We've got a bunch of green onions. These can go right into the crisper drawer of your fridge loose. Those are super nice. Um, can be used like an onion in a salad or any other sort of dish got a big zucchini this week that can go right into your crisper drawer and we've got a couple peppers of different kinds of pepper um, a green pepper a jalapeno pepper these can go these can also go loose in your veggie drawer um, I know Lauren mentioned sometimes she likes to wrap up her hot peppers just so it doesn't spread the heat to other things so you could do that or you could just keep them loose in your crisper drawer We've got a fresh Walla Walla onion this week. It hasn't been cured, so it doesn't have that skin on it. Um, so you're gonna wanna keep this in the fridge and eat it within two to three weeks. We've got a few daikon radishes. These can get stored in your, um, in your drawer of your fridge too. And then when you're ready to eat them, just you can um, wash or just peel off this outer layer, slice them up. They're super good. Raw in salads or with hummus or something like that. Um, we're super excited about our sweet corn this week, of course, love sweet corn. So you're gonna want to eat this as soon as possible. Sweet corn is best fresh. Um, so we're gonna peel it tonight and boil it in hot water, um, in boiling water, and then just eat it with some butter and salt. You can keep it on ice if you're not gonna eat it right away, but I think you should eat that tonight. Um, we've got a bunch of mint, this, and if you're not using it right away, you can keep this like in a damp paper towel um, and store it in your fridge that way. You could also stick it in a little glass of water and keep it on your counter um, or in the fridge. But the damp paper towel is a really nice idea for keeping that fresh and then putting it in the fridge. Two cucumbers this week. Those can go in your in your drawer in your fridge. Um, I know if you're wondering out of running out of cucumber ideas, Lauren posted a recipe um, in the Facebook page that looks super, super delicious. So I would check that out. It's for a really good looking cucumber salad. And then we've got a big bunch of kale. This can get stored um, in your veggie drawer or you can put it, wrap it loosely in a plastic bag and just keep it in the fridge. Um, I think mentioned a recipe a couple weeks ago that's from the New York Times that um, where you make a sauce just out of a whole bunch of kale that's super delicious. So I will also post that to the Facebook page later tonight. So, wow, look at that. That is this week's um, small share. Enjoy all these beautiful veggies. Take care.